Well, given, given it was a race, I mean, it, it, getting to the moon was clearly a race back in the day. But yeah, as you say, you were racing against other billionaires. How, how pleased were you to be the first to beat Mr. Bezos? Do you know, those, I, I, I hate the word billionaire. I mean, I... I, um, uh, I Why do you hate it? See, I see myself as somebody who uh, loves to create things. Um, uh, and, you know, I mean, for instance, th you know, 38 years ago, mm. I, I created Virgin Atlantic with one secondhand 747. And, you know, th and, and 38 years later, that, you know, the, the, the team there are still as motivated and happy working for the company as they were th 38 years ago. And, and it's offering real competition to British Airways. Um, more recently, you know, we've created, I think, the best cruise line, Virgin Virgin Voyages in the world, where, you know, people who go on it absolutely love it and and are coming back for more. And I think we've got all the details right. Now, the the I've never thought of going into these businesses with the idea of making lots of money. What, I, what, what I've tried to do is create things that people like and, and 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 that enhance the virgin brand and the reputation and that and that at the end of the year more money comes in than goes out um and uh and uh and so i think uh you know calling somebody by you know uh by their you know by, by their wealth is, is is slightly demeaning i think i think that um you know that i am an entrepreneur mm. um and and I and and I'm proud of well, proud I wonder, of what I wonder then to to what extent you feel that actually there's a bit of an underappreciation or a lack of appreciation about what that process uh, of exploring, engineering, building, creating, and yes, m maybe at the end of the month more money comes in than goes out. What it actually brings that that sort of capitalist model perhaps has been under a bit of a uh, of attack recently and people don't appreciate the benefits of what private enterprise can actually bring i think that's true i mean i think the i think a lot of people do appreciate it and 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 i think there are some that don't i mean you know if i if i uh, you know there's there's a documentary series yeah. on h called uh, you know called branson um which has just come, come running or, um and um and you know, it shows that you know here, here that I, as as a young boy, you know, with two two hundred pounds from my mum being able to sell a sell a necklace um, uh, that she found on the street and and it, which the police nobody claimed. Um, that, that, you know, we use that two hundred pounds to build the you know the Virgin Empire. Um, uh, 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 you know, whether it was record companies or, or whatever, but it but um, you know so. You know, I, th I think I've employed nearly a million and a half people yeah. in my life. I was going to say that it's brought greater benefit than just for yourself, which is what people see. They see you and they, you know, understand everything that you've done to get to the point where you are. But actually, you've employed a hell of a lot of people. You've created competition to drive prices down, whether it's on the trains, in on planes or in space. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I, I'm, I, I'm, that, that would be my defence. <laughs> <laughs>